Hey guys, Everything Apple Pro here, and in this video I'm going to be showing you how to install iOS 8.1 Beta 1 in Developer Preview as I promised. So yesterday Apple did release this new firmware, there's not a lot that's changed, but most importantly, probably Camera Roll is back. So if you guys want to download this firmware and check it out, up to you. I personally would not recommend using it as your day-to-day -day device, you know, install it on a device that you don't use every single day. It's always interesting seeing, you know, the latest firmware and how Apple has changed things, but in this video, I'm going to show you how to do that for free. No developer account necessary, no UDID registration needed. This is really simple. Now, this firmware to me is just a little bit more stable. Again, I wouldn't recommend installing it on your day to day device, but I personally have seen less crashing on it than iOS 8.0.2. Now, should you guys install this and then change your minds, it's really easy to downgrade. You know, it's not permanent. It's really simple, but of course you need to back up all of your data before beginning any of this. And should you decide to downgrade, I will have links down below in the description to where you can downgrade from iOS 8.1 beta 1 to the newest 8.0.2 with no problems. Anyways, so let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so here on my desktop, as you guys can see, I already have iOS 8.1 beta 1. Now you guys will need to download this and I'll provide links from another person down below in the description. Go ahead and click on that and then drag it to your desktop when it's done. Now this does work on both Mac and Window computers. Make sure your device is plugged in and let's go ahead and begin. So go ahead and open up iTunes. In iTunes, navigate to your device. Now in here, if you're on a Mac computer, hold the option key and you're gonna to wanna to left click check for update. If you're on Windows, you're gonna to wanna to hold the shift key. Now my firmware is on my desktop. Let's go ahead and scroll down to iOS 8.1 and go ahead and select open. Now this device is already on 8.1, but just click it for the heck of it. So it won't actually update. But for you guys, you should have no problems here. It'll update onto iOS 8.1 beta one from your older firmware. As long as you don't hit restore iPhone, you guys will be good, no activation errors. So it's as simple as that. And while this is updating, I just wanna tell you guys, iOS 8.1 is gonna be coming out very soon because Apple has just hit a huge mess with 8.0.2 and 8.0. I've never experienced that much glitching and crashing on any iOS firmware as I have on iOS 8. So Apple is really hurrying up with the updates and we should be seeing the final version very soon. But for now, you guys are free to try iOS 8.1. Now it's gonna take about 10, 15 minutes, you know, just hold your device steady, don't do anything, don't unplug it, otherwise it will break it. And if you guys are concerned about data, make sure to back up everything prior to attempting this. And once your device does restart, you guys will be running iOS 8.1, as you guys can see right here. So in my previous video, I'll put a link up here, you know, just check it out, what's new in iOS 8.1. There's really not much aside from a couple of tweaks in the settings. And as you can see, iBooks has changed, but the biggest and most notable change is the fact that camera roll is now back in iOS 8. Yay, Apple. So it's as simple as that. Hope this video helped you guys get iOS 8. And again, if you guys have any troubles, just want to downgrade, links are down below in the description to where you can do that. Have a great day, guys. Enjoy iOS 8.1 beta 1. Peace.